Hi guys, today we're going to talk about Prince Harry, the Duke of Sussex. Prince Harry has just agreed to a settlement with the Mirror Group. Prince Harry sued the Mirror Group for using hacking methods in order to gather information about him. Prince Harry pointed the finger at Piers Morgan, saying that Piers Morgan, who was the managing director of the paper at the time, was in fact aware of the use of these practices, and he said that he should be prosecuted. To which Piers Morgan replied that, he didn't want to accept anything from Prince Harry, which is ridiculous. It's just a diversion. He didn't negate what Prince Harry was saying. He didn't say, no, I didn't do that. He just tried to deflect on the royal family, which has nothing to do with him. On top of that, I just want to mention that Piers Morgan has decided to part ways with Rupert Murdoch to own Talk TV. He's bringing his TV show on YouTube. He was already on YouTube, but he decided to dedicate his time to that, which is quite ironic because he was the one slamming the YouTubers, belittling them, and now he's a full-fetched YouTuber now, albeit a very rich one because he's making tons of money with his YouTube channel. But still, it's so lame of him to actually become a YouTuber when himself had the little YouTubers had said that it's not a proper job, had called on to them to, to find a job, and he's doing just the same now. And also, he used to say that Meghan Markle and Prince Harry will end up on YouTube. And guess who is on YouTube right now? The reason why she's creating talk TV has nothing to do with the judgment on Harry. I think it has to do with the fact that he's making loads of money because some of his videos have like millions and millions of views. And it's a lot of money. So that's what I wanted to say. Let me know what you think. Hope you like the video. Feel free to click on like it's the case. Subscribe for more videos and click on the notification bell to be notified when I post a new video. Thank you.